I, I think there's an enormous difference in the way I see problems uh, today as governor uh, compared to 1978 when I left public office uh, before. Uh, of course, part of it is age. Uh, I certainly retain a, a deep commitment to civil rights and, uh, and civil liberties. I, that's a part of me and I'm never going to lose that. But on the other hand, uh, years of, uh, of being in business, of making a payroll, uh, of raising a family and getting kids through the public schools, of, uh, of going through uh, some serious challenges to my health, uh, uh, life-threatening challenges. Uh, all have a, a shaping influence on you. So uh, whether I'm, I'm looking uh, uh, at things differently just because I'm older, or whether it's the sum of all the experiences from Vietnam and prosecutor and Congress to business and raising the family, uh, I, I think I see problems uh, in a way that are different. I recognize that we don't have enough money to do all the things we want to do. So we have to choose, and choices are hard. They're hard in the family and they're hard in government, uh, but there's only so much money to go around, and we have a real duty to try and get the very best value and results possible out of the resources we have available. Now, those are serious challenges and serious choices. And one of the things that, uh, that is upsetting to me is when I hear uh, politicians use a lot of rhetoric about how we're going to fix this or fix that or do something. Uh, and they are unwilling to come to grips with the uh, resources required to solve those problems. In business, you have to sit down and say, all right, here's the challenge that we have to meet. What are the resources we have with which to get there? Uh, and that becomes a part of the habit of your life. I think those are techniques that translate well to government. I don't think you can run government like a business, but I think you can be businesslike about the way you conduct government, uh, being thoughtful in how you spend your money, recognizing that every choice to spend money in one fashion is taking money away from something else. And uh, that is, in fact, part of the business of being a good governor.